to me an outsider, that's all that matters. Yeah, it it doesn't seem like any of these designers are ever successful at shaking the the limbs of the tree. Do you feel like, uh, and and I could be totally wrong on this, but do you feel like that it's because these brands are too big to have the tree shaken like that? Yeah, I think that, you know, I give credit to guys like Virgil, you know, over at Louis Vuitton and, you know, he's pushed it. He's been able to do it. For every person who hates on that guy, you're not recognizing that this man has been able to do things that no other designer at a luxury house has been able to break through, you know? And I respect that. Just like that's why I get Is excited Kanye about- Is Kanye in that camp too? Um, I mean, just because he hasn't worked at a luxury house and gotten and shaken up a brand. Yes, he did it with Adidas, but I also argue that like, Adidas literally just said, go make a brand and we'll pay for it, you know? And like, we'll get some cool marketing tail out of that. I think about it less than maybe. I mean, yes, that's probably the biggest example of it. Maybe I'm fucking wrong. Is like to say, yes, Kanye was handed the keys and it was just a go. Yeah. Like I have friends who work for that that whole camp and like literally Kanye would be like, I want a factory in Wyoming. And they'll be like, cool, factory in Wyoming will be on a boat from Germany happening in, and it'll be there by next week and we're going to build it. And then he'll have it built and he'll be like, I want it two miles away. And they'll go move it two miles away. There at one point where, and this is a maybe top secret, who knows? That I'm not on any NDA with Adidas, so who cares? But they were literally like going to build factories on planes for them to fly with wherever Kanye was going. You can think about how expensive that is uh, and the cost of just scaling that. But those were like the ways that they were thinking, right? And like, that's pretty crazy. That's crazy. But it says that's how much need. he was able to go fuck up the brand and help them think differently because A, he gets to push the needle for them, do good business big sales. That's great. I think that it just helps people to think about the brand way differently. And so you associate easy with Adidas and then you immediately bring more value back to the Adidas brand. And by letting him go fuck it up, you now like Adidas that more. 